Hey guys, this is Code with Shark. Today we are going to be making this rhythm master game. First, let's create a, a new project. Now let's make the panel that we can press on. For it to work for you, so if it's following exactly, I recommend if you do it pure red first. And the color is zero. Well, it doesn't matter the color. And there is going the size you want it to to be. You want the height to be a hundred seventy three. Okay, and you want the width to be 223. Okay, there. Now, we can do our first script. When green flag is clicked, we want to hide it because there's going to be some cloning in this one project. We need to create ID for this right only. That part is very important. So first we want to set ID to one. And we wanted to go to your position. It will be negative 115, and the y axis will be 90. And then we know to do crit clone myself. And then we want to change color effect by 25. And at the end, we want to do change ID by one. Duplicate this once. Train this. To positive 155. Duplicate this. And then just change this one to a negative 90. Change this to negative 90. And at the last. We don't need this and change this. We have changes to 60, I think, I'm pretty sure. Oh yeah, and when I start as a clone, show. Doom. Da -da. As you can see. Now, you need to put in a Forever, if new equals one, when you make a new variable called new, just in case the previous player finished the level, and then I have to set okay. So now we need to do two more, one more variable for now. We need it. It's called beat. If beat equals uh, 
ID. Then we wanted to. Change brightness. Change color. Change of brightness. By sixty. Wait. One point five seconds. And then change brightness by negative 60, and then wait 0 0.5 seconds. And now, let's move over here and do when green flag is clicked, we need another variable called i. When green flag is clicked, set i. Two, one. And also, we want to put set rhythm. I need a new variable, I'm going to just call it RY for short. Rhythm to blink. Oh yeah, over here we need to set our new to one. And forever if New equals one. Then we want to start this kind of complicated process. So first we want to set beat to and we need to go into the operators, pick random one to four and then we only need to set r y so r y to r y join beat and then we wait two seconds And then set beat to nothing. And then at the end of the repeat loop, set new to zero. And this main script for the clone forever if new equals zero that means the things are done flashing then we want to do repeat for wait until And you put in the and, touching your mouse pointer, and mouse down. Then, you need to put in if, oh, and you, it has to be an if else. You need to put in an equal if id equals we need the i and ry equals 
letter I of R Y. Then we're going to change I by one or else stop all since I mean the user got it wrong. And when you put it down here, a wait until not touch your mouse pointer or then it will automatically do stop it all because that's quick real very quick reaction. Put in here if I is bigger than four set new to one and we want to set I back to one and set R Y to blank. And now let's give it some sound. So choose a sound we want to do. Uh, for one, I want to do. I like the one collect to I want. Collect. Start sound collect right here. And then start sound collect right here. And I need another sound. It's going to be called clang. That means user got it wrong. Play clang. Until done and stop. Stop all and look over here and green side is clutch forever. Play a sound. We just need to choose a sound. I really I really like this one called dance one. Dance funky until done. And as you see now, uh oh, the move starts amazing. And let's if we get it wrong, and then boom. But to make something better, is that. That I didn't have in mind is that if this is correct, then I wanted to change the brightness effect and wait 0 0.5 seconds just just so it can fly. That means it's correct. Now let's see. And to add something just to make it a little bit better, let's just add score. Good old score. We just want to set score to zero here, and then down here, one change score by one. Let's see. Oh, never mind. I wasn't paying attention. So, yellow, yellow, blue, yeah. So, yeah.
too. Okay, and right before it, here, we, I just want to do wait 0 0.5 seconds and sound. I'm just gonna add a wind sound. No, I need all an effect. Hmm. I can make it a little bit faster. Oh, never mind. That's softer, though. Okay. When they got it done, start sound one. You know, here instead of, instead of collect. We can use a little bit different one coin. And actually, instead of wand here, we can do coin. And over here, instead of coin, delete wand. And We just need I just like this gluck sound. Just wait one second, and this is actually it for our rhythm game. I hope you enjoy this video. See you in my next video.